What's up? What's up, guys? We got a request a long time ago by a, this person that's on the screen. Can you make a giant onion ring? And I'm thinking to myself, how the heck do we do that? You can't just find a giant onion. Onion! So this is more like a challenge video. You guys are going to come along with us as we hopefully don't struggle too much to make a giant onion ring. So what we're gonna do is take our onions. We didn't know how many we we're gonna need to make our giant onion ring, so we bought five. Hopefully it's enough. Let's chop the onion up first. Bring it right over to our food processor. I'm coming. So this whole house is just gonna smell like onion. You looking forward to it? No, I hope it works. Got to find out. It broke. Let's try again. She broke it. Ooh, there's a lot of liquid in there. Yeah, I think all we gotta do is pipe this, freeze it. It'll be the circle of the onion, and then all we do is bread it. Looks like uh, lemon ice. Yeah, don't eat that though. Try a one just pureed onion in the bag. This might be a fail, but we're gonna freeze this anyways. Oh no. It didn't work. It didn't work, and the onion is all in the air now, and I can't even see anymore, and I'm starting to tear up. We need to go to trial two. Too much moisture, too much water. Trial number two. Let's do this. I got half a cup of flour here. Just gonna pour some flour in. Stir this up. This will do a little bit more. It's starting to thicken up a little bit. All right, that's quarter cup. Looks like mush. All right. Actually, you know what it reminds me of? Porridge. Cream of wheat. Pudding. If you hold this by your eyes for too long, seriously, you're gonna have eye damage. This is ridiculous, but we're gonna season our onion with onion powder and onion salt because our onion doesn't taste like onion. This is so much easier. Oh my God, JP, flour might have fixed everything. So this actually looks good. Without a doubt, this is going in the freezer. Oh, there's no space. I'm just gonna make it as big as this plate. Again, we have no space. Now do ice cream. So I'm gonna make room for you. All right, guys, it is now tomorrow. It's been an entire day. Can you just shut that cabinet? Day two, giant onion ring. We got our onion rings in the freezer. They should be hard right now. Hard or frozen? They kind of look like uh, calamari. There's the big one. It's like the weirdest thing I've ever seen. It's totally hard. It's like a fossil. Mm -hmm. All right. I've heard that it's best to crack an egg on a flat surface. That way you don't uh, break the yolk. I broke the yolk. All right, do you want me to get it on you? You're not gonna finish? This is your step. I don't like being on camera. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I'm nervous. So our mixing station is quite simple, consists of three bowls. We got our flour bowl, we got our egg wash, and we got our panko, because Burger King uses panko, I think. Flour, egg. Egg. All right, so we got our giant ring. It's like a bracelet. So we're just gonna repeat the same steps with the big ring, and then into the freezer one more time. We're doing the VIP stream early today. What up, Jeffrey Rugg is on. Guys, we are on live raise right now, VIP only, because they get to be in the video. So we're gonna deep fry both of the smaller ones now, and then we're gonna do our giant, giant one a little bit later because it still has to freeze. Make sure your oil's at 350 degrees Fahrenheit, and we fried these for about two to three minutes or until golden brown. Guys, this is a Burger King onion ring. I don't like how I say the word onion. I gotta see how this thing tastes. One test bite for the health of it. See, I'm doing the slogan for Julia, because Julia wants me to do the slogan. Ooh, that crunch, that sounds like Burger King. Wow, these taste like the stuff you put on green bean casserole. This tastes just like it, JP, I'm not even kidding. I think this is it. Yeah, it tastes just like it. Let's make a giant one. Yes. Let's do it.
Uh oh. Uh oh. You let my giant onion ring die. You still made a giant one. This one's just the giant's daddy. So thankfully our smaller onion ring didn't break. Here goes nothing. <gasps> so this might not be giant, but it is larger than regular size. And ours came out beautiful. All right guys, it's been like two days, three trials. He got a haircut. I got a haircut. Different shirt. We made a couple mistakes along the way and we, we got this. We got a giant onion this, ring. This is what we got. But this is really quite large and guys, you can do this too. I just like holding it. Oh, by the way, this is zesty sauce. We didn't show you how to make it in the video, but if you want to see how to make zesty sauce. Look right here. That's right. And you need a massive bowl of sauce in order to dip your massive onion ring. Oh man. One bite for the health of it. Mm. Oh my God, that's delicious. Look at that. And you can just see the onion. It tastes like a Burger King onion ring. Oh my God, look at the onion in there. Especially with that zesty sauce, dude. Ooh. Holy onion ring mole. It's so good. This is amazing. This is like the best onion ring I've ever had in my life. <laughs> Guys, we did it. We made this giant onion ring. It tastes like an onion ring. It tastes like Burger King. We've gone through such a transformation. I went to the gym, mm -hmm. I showered, and uh, I tanned. You did laundry. So yo, you want to come make your own onion ring? I'll hook you up. I'll give you an offer you can review. Guys, comment below what other giant things do you want to see us make in the future? We made something giant. If you want to make giant things too, make sure to do it take a photo of it, send it to us, and we will put it on our website. And if you want to see more things like this, make sure to check out these videos here and here. We'll see you next time on another episode of Healthy Junk Food. Can I get another onion ring? Well, we only have one. <laughs>